So, now let us discuss problems on permutations and combinations first very short answer type questions. So, V s a q. So, that is 2 marks plus 2 marks total 4 marks that means 2 very short answer type questions will appear from this chapter. This is very easy just if you follow the these questions. The first question if n p 4 is equal to 1680 find n this is the question. So, now what is n p 4? What is n p 4 means? 4 blank places are filled with n different objects without repetition or we have the formula n p r. What is the formula for n p r? n p r formula is n factorial over r factorial of n minus r factorial that will be very lengthy because it is a very short answer type questions. So, we can do so in the previous method also 4 places are filled with n different objects without repetition. So, now let us solve this question given n p 4 is equal to 1680. So, now this n p 4 can be written. So, first place n ways, second place is n minus 1, third place is n minus 2, fourth place is n minus 3 am I correct is equal to this 1680 we can write. So, 168 into 10 let us try 9. So, now this is 9 1 ja 9 ok 9 2 ja 18 9 1 ja 9 means here uh, 16 minus 9 is how much 78. So, better you try 8 also no problem 8 into 21 8 2 ja 16 into 10 this 8 into 21 can be written as uh, 7 into 3 into 10. Okay. Now, this is we can write 1, 2, 3, 4. This 8 into 7 into 3 into 5 into 2 write down. This is now we can write now 8 into 7 into 6 into 5. Now, see here 4 places are filled with 8 objects. 8 ways, 7 ways, 6 ways, 5 ways. That means here n equals to 8. Therefore, n is equal to 8. Now, let us move to the next problem. Now, second problem. If 12 pr is equal to 1320 find r value. Here also here r places are filled with 12 objects. So, that is equal to 1320. So, first in this problem 12 p r equal to 1320 let us think about 1320. This 1320 can be written 132 into 10. First let us factors like this. Let us try this is 12 into 11 into 10. So, this is ok 12 into 11 into 10. So, that means this 12 p r again we can write 12 into 11 into 10. That means 12 different objects are filled in 3 places that can be written 
this is 12 p 3. So, that means 12 p r equals to 12 p 3. Now, what is the value of r? Very simple, this r is 3, therefore, r is equal to 3. Now, let us move to the third problem. So, third one, if n plus 1 p phi is is to n p phi is equal to 3 is to 2, then find n then find n this is the question. So, now here given n plus 1 p phi is to n p phi is equal to 3 is to 2. So, can we write like this? n plus 1 p phi by n p phi equals to 3 by 2. I already discussed in the previous problems n plus 1 p phi means 5 empty places are filled with n plus 1 objects without repetition. Similarly, n phi, phi means 5 empty places are filled with n 